Treasurer Jim Chalmers has handed down his third federal budget. Let's get straight into who wins, who loses, and what this budget means for you. First, let's look at the losers. While everyone gets a tax cut, high income earners get a fair bit less than they would have under Morrison's plan. Treasury has inflation heading in one direction, down, while the Reserve Bank says the opposite. They can't both be right. The mental health sector will get just an extra $111 million a year, a relatively small amount compared to the previous government. Now the winners. All of us get more energy bill relief. This time, it's $300 off over the course of the year. There's a promise to build 1.2 million new homes over five years, an overall spend of $32 billion. And there's $3 billion for pharmacists, and the price of PBS scripts will be frozen at $31.60 for a year. For the full list of winners and losers, visit the links in the description.